Now, good morning. So, I had a request to try a roundabout with this version of the software. And it just so happens I found that um, here in Annandale, okay, is there a yellow light? It's still yellow. That's good. Uh, here in Annandale, there's a mini modular roundabout that was installed, I think, 2018. I've never seen it before. This would be the first time, probably, full self-driving scene, and I'm guessing, but who knows. But we'll see how it handles it. I saw pictures on online. There's a website from the uh, Virginia Department of Transportation. It doesn't look too much unlike any roundabouts I've seen before, except it's constructed of uh, PVC or non-concrete asphalt materials. It's bright yellow. Alright, we're about half a mile here from the roundabout that we're going to test out. And I should probably... Alright, it's, it's set to go straight. I'm going to read nav to here because I want it to go three quarters of the way around the roundabout. Okay, here we go. Roundabout. It should have gone in because we had the yield. Okay, it's not. Yeah, not not good. That one did not work. So it was a very different shape roundabout than I expected. It wasn't exactly round. <laughs> kind of at sharp edges. Let's try it again. In the parking lot. We'll try to have it go around. Let's just have it go. try to go straight through. And here we go. Does see it. It's purple. Pause, waiting for our turn, waiting for cross traffic, and now it's gonna go. And it did not. <laughs> okay, we'll just try the right turn out of the roundabout. Maybe that's easier. And I'm gonna engage autopilot. disengage and we'll try it again all right I'm gonna drive around it a couple times myself to see if it if there is any kind of learning this is uh, totally driving myself I just sent that in all right. coming in kind of fast slows down waits for the turn hesitant but it worked that was uh, that was much better so I'm disengaged <clears throat> I'm gonna find a safe place to pull over reset the navigation to try to go to the third exit That's a little weird. Oh, came to a stop that was... It basically is trying to run over the roundabout. 
it sees it on the screen. I'm just not sure if this type of roundabout is new. So this is going to be really interesting to see how my feedback improves the, uh, the software. Alright, this time it was set at 25. Now it's loaded to 15 for the speed bump. This will probably be the last time I try this roundabout today. Put the bl right blinker on. I wouldn't have done that. Alright, here we go. Put the left blinker on. There's no other traffic on the route they're coming. It's waiting. It should have gone in, but it didn't, and it goes straight. So. I drove around a couple times manually, and uh, I don't, I don't know, just make sure that's sent. Whether or not it's the roundabouts in general on this software release, or it's that specific mini modular roundabout that's installed, we will try that again in the future. Thanks for watching, and please subscribe so you can see that update. Oh, another roundabout. Hey, wait. All right, that worked great. I'm gonna go back now, of course, because this is a small roundabout, but it's clearly defined. More traditional style. Okay, so here we go. This roundabout is clearly shown in the map data that it's a roundabout. We're on the side of the road, autopilot's ready, so here we go. It's carefully pulled out. Uh, there's a car coming out of the driveway here, so well, let's see how that, oh, it's okay, it's waiting for me, so the car is carefully going. Oh, it's only set to uh, 10 miles an hour, so the speed limit's 25, I'll manual up. Has the left turn signal on, which is technically where we're going. I would just would never put on left turn signal. Stopped, safely entered. Oh, very jerky, but it did it. Okay. There's no traffic here, so I'm fine with that. Uh, but it was very jerky. But the car did successfully navigate the roundabout. Make sure there was no traffic in the intersection. All right. Should be proceeding straight through the traffic circle. This one has a stop instead of a yield, which I have never seen before for a rotary, rotary or traffic circle. And then it hesitated, no traffic, but did did successfully navigate.